Dave, when he speaks to somebody, it's not about how am I going to sell this person on my idea or on this product? How am I going to make this person laugh? But rather, how am I going to impact this person? He has impacted so many lives that I have witnessed, and I'm sure you have as well. And if he hasn't impacted yours yet, get your popcorn ready because it's coming. I'd like to introduce to you my brother who's running for Sherryland ISD School Board Place 7, David Keith. Hey guys, my name is Josh Alvarez. I'm a former student of Coach Keith, and I can, I can vouch and I can testify that he's a great guy. He put up with, with a lot of my nonsense back in high school, and he approached, he approached every moment with love, with a passion. And I actually caught up with Mr. Keith a couple years after graduating with the Sons of God Ministry, and we would gather here in Sherryland for Bible study and serve the community. Great guy all around. And one thing I could guarantee you about Coach Keith, he does things with a heart, he does things with a passion, and he's one of the few teachers that always had that fire burning in him. He is a God-fearing, loving husband, loving father to his children. In as far as politically and what he could do for the community um, and for the school district, I know that his goal, as he has children as well that attend school, he's going to do the best he can to make sure that the children have the best education. I know nothing will sway him. If it's right, he's gonna stand for that because of his fear of God and not of man. Uh, Callie and Gavin, the twins, they're at the table there when you came in. Raise your hand, you guys, raise your hand. Those are the twins. Liv, my youngest, she's an eighth grader at Sherry North. So if, yeah. So if you, if you don't know what's going to happen next year, Callie's going to be a junior. Liv is going to be a freshman, and they'll be one will be at Pioneer, and the other will be at Sherryland High School. So, I have a split household, and I believe that right there qualifies me enough to be your next Sherryland School Board Play Seven. Yeah. And that was good. I didn't even plan that. That just came out right now. Hi, I'm Gavin Keith, and I go to Sherryland High School. Hello, I'm Liv Keith, and I go to Sherry North. I'm Kelly Keith, and I also go to Sherryland High School. And Coach Key started? Yeah, yeah, Coach Key started that. And, like, he puts us first no matter what. If he has, like, something to do for work, he, and I have an appointment, like, he tries so hard to get me out of school. He's like, he never misses an appointment. Yeah. So, an inside from, uh, scoop on, yeah, like, from, uh, how life as a student actually students. is. Yeah, from actual students that go to yeah. Sherry. He's just always been a stand-up guy. He's always been a strong Christian man, and uh, he's always supported my son. Uh, even though he never really coached him directly, he supported him. He's always been for the the, the Sherryland kids, and he's a, just a Sherryland guy. I hang my hat on this. My first assistant was Rene Gonzalez. He's head coach at Pioneer. My second assistant coach is the head coach at Sherryland High School. The third assistant coach I had is the head coach at Bella High School. And that's, I think that's a sign of leadership, one, and that's a sign of finding the right people finding the right people for the position, for what the position requires. And that's how I feel about this place in Sherryland for this school board position. I left coaching and I'm now a businessman and I want to serve. My husband has been in the army, a teacher, a coach, a father. His ethics, his loyalty, his dedication um, makes him a prime candidate for place seven. Honey, what do you what do you think about the campaign? How do you think it's going? I think it's going really well. We had a great turnout tonight. We had um, community members from both sides, from Mission, Callan, and um, Sherryland, and they came here to support Mr. Keith. So I played basketball under Coach Keith uh, over a decade ago now, and one of the first memories I have with Coach Keith is after I suffered a knee injury in football, I remember rather than just seeing me as another athlete to help his team win, uh, what Coach Keith did was he told me that it doesn't matter how quickly I can come back. Yeah, he would like to have me on the team, but he said, make sure that you are healthy. Make sure that your knee's okay, it's taken care of. And if you'd like to come play with me, then that would be awesome. And that's something that I think is very important is as an educator, as a coach, someone who's working with kids, is to see them as 
a person first as an individual, not just as someone who's, who you see as a benefit to yourself. And as soon as he opens the door, the kid runs, now, now a man runs in and grabs Eddie. Everybody's in tears, you can imagine. He's telling me this. Everybody's in tears. And the kid said these words. He said, you saved my life. Eddie didn't even know didn't know what he had done. And so when you think into that and you think of all the hundreds of thousands of teachers that impact your child's life, my kid's life in the classroom, on the court, on the field, in the hallways, in the parking lots, all those that access they have, teachers and administration and the staff are so, so important. As I've gotten to know Coach Keith, you know, I've really gained and respect for him. Um, just to hear his story, to hear where he's come from, to hear what he's done. But probably the most heartwarming thing for me um, is to see his students come back and, and support him in the way that they have. And for him to just genuinely care about kids the way they have. Um, to see them come back and be like, hey coach, I'm here for you. That's what being on the school board is all about. We, we serve our kids and to actually have the impact that he's had on his kids, I'm excited at the possibility of serving with him. He's doing this for the right reasons. He's uh, he's running to to better the community. So Coach David Keith is running for Sherryland School Board Place Seven. He's got my vote because knowing that he's spent 18 years in the classroom and knowing the impact he had on me as a person. Uh, I believe he can take that to another level on the school board and really help Sherwin ISD as a whole and have a big impact and have a positive difference. So that's why he has my vote. Great guy all around and hopefully all the Rattlers, all the class of 2006, 2005, we can come out and support Coach Keith. Oh, yeah. I mean, one of the key parts of this is to get a voter group. So um, by any chance, have you decided who you're going to vote for? This Sherryland ISD School Board Place Seven election. Um, um, a good candidate in mind, and I know it would be yours too. Yeah. It's you. All right. That's <laughs> <laughs> so cheesy. <laughs> I like Coach David Keith for Sherryland School Board Place Seven. All in for Sherryland ISD. Oh. Was that good? You said I would do greater things than you.